Duff's tough night at the office, a narrow two one defeat to Altrincham. What did you make of it? Thought it was a really good game, um, really competitive. Um, you know, I think if you spoke to Alty, they'd, they'd say the same. You know, um, it was a really, really good game, and to be honest, I'm really pleased with the performance of the lads. You know, they've, they've taken you know Alty from right, right to the final whistle. Um, the amount of chances that they created, got in the final third so many times. And you know, we just lacked that little bit of end product tonight. But look, the main thing is we're getting in those positions and that's something for us to work on, is, is that final ball. It was a real close encounter, like you say, great test, both sides battling it out despite the result, it was just a really good run out, wasn't it, for the lads? Yeah, definitely, and I think you know, you don't want games that you, you, you coast through and you know, you're winning three, four nils and stuff like that. You, they need those competitive matches and like I said before, um, you know, if you spoke to them, I think they'll be really pleased with, with the game themselves because it, it was it was like a league game. Um, there was a few tackles. The, there was players really, you know, going hammer and tongue at it. To be honest, and I said just a pleasing thing for me it was, you know, um, the, the lads showed real, real good desire uh, in togetherness. Obviously, to go two 0 down and fight back and get themselves back in the game and. We had plenty of opportunities to score, so yeah, it was a really good night at the office. Just three changes to the side from Saturday's win at Telford. Is that another sign of things to come, would you say, in terms of the faces we can expect to see start the season? Um, obviously, we're still looking at players. You know, we, we had you know five players come into the building. Um, we, we feel as if we'll give everyone a fair opportunity. To, um, we'll give everyone a, a fair share of the minutes. Um, but uh, as I say, we're still looking at certain things, players in certain positions. We've got players to come back. We had. You know, um, obviously Tom Thorpe wasn't here tonight, Sam Heathcote and Kenji wasn't here. Um, these are big players for us who will come back and make that, that squad even, even stronger. Um, but yeah, look, overall just a really pleasing night. Despite the possible changes that you still made, made, made to the side ahead of the season, it must have just been frustrating to fall behind early on tonight regardless. Yeah, it was because I, I thought it was quite even, to be honest. I, I, in, in the first, you know, open phase of the match, um, and they just overloaded one side, and um, they just played the ball down the side, and we had to look at it again. Um, I feel as if someone should really go out there with with that man, try and stop that cross. It was too easy for them to, to get it across, and then the fellas just come in on the back post and he, he put it in. So, um, from their point of view, probably a well worked goal. Um, from our point of view, I, I think we need to defend that better. It wasn't just one-way traffic though, there was plenty of match chance in the first half. Ultimately, they weren't taken. I'm sure you'd just rather that happen now rather than rather than later on at the start of the season. Yeah, definitely. And, and I've just said to the players, look, you know, they're the full-time team. Um, there's a lot of things that they've worked on. Um, we don't have that luxury quite quite yet um, to, to have you know so much time on the grass and stuff. But you know, the things that we are trying to implement, I'm really pleased with how the players are doing it. You know, we, we do work really hard and trying to get in certain areas of the pitch, especially down the sides of teams and you know putting balls across the box and it's just you know working on those little little fine margins now um, and just making sure that players are in the box when we do get in there because if they do they'll score a lot of goals in this team. Alti second was a surprise to everyone. I think it's fair to say again one to get out of the way now, isn't it? Yeah, look, obviously the, the way we set up, <coughs> um, we're trying to keep a high line. Um, we want the goalkeeper to be in an aggressive starting position. Um, I haven't had the chance to see the goal back yet, but he's probably slightly over a little bit. Um, I'm not quite sure what's happened with the wall, if the wall's in the correct position, but as you've just touched on, um, it's probably better to get it out, out of the way now, um, rather than in, in the season. Kane Drummond managed to pull one back 15 minutes before the end. It looked like you might have snatched something from the game at that point, didn't it? Yeah. Say you know it was a really close game from the first whistle to be honest, um, and just on Kane, you know, he's playing he's playing some really really top level football. You know, um, he's come back in great condition. Um, you know, his aggression, his desire, his quality. Um, he's listened to what people have said, um, and, and he's reaping the rewards of that. I think you know from game to game he's, he's growing. Will be a big play for us this season. Plenty to be pleased about tonight, and like you say, despite the scoreline, uh, and I'm sure you won't let it deter you from the progress or the good progress we've already made in pre-season, especially when it's come to competing with teams at a high level. 
No, like you should have said then, it's, it's, it's all learning for us and, you know, we, we never get too high and we never get too low. Um, it, it's pre-season and um, all the cliches about the minutes in the legs and stuff like that, 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 that is, you know, key. But like I have said, it is about building momentum and tonight is a very, very good night for us because we've shown that we compete. We can compete with a team from a high division who's full time. Um, arguably, probably had better chances. Um, fitness levels look really good. So you know, there's so many positive, t you know, boxers that were ticked there tonight. And um, it's still a couple of weeks from the start of the season, so we've still got loads to work on. And you know, we will get better as a team. Well, we're back on the road away at Bromsgrove on Saturday. I'm sure you're just looking to get back to winning ways there. Yeah, definitely. I'd say it will be another tough test. Um, travelling away to Bromsgrove, um, you know, obviously the lads are going to be off tomorrow um, and then we'll just see them Saturday and we'll just analyse tonight's game and then, yeah, just, just look forward to the game Saturday then. Brilliant, thanks very much, Dustin.